Most people know that sharpening your mower blade is super duper important and it helps your grass in many different ways throughout the year. I want to show you how you can sharpen your mower blade easier and more efficiently. Make it so that you can actually get the job done far more often than you ever have before. But first, I really got to actually cut the grass here. The grass is starting to get a little bit overgrown and we might be getting some rain today, so I'm a little bit short on time. Dad, stop! What are you doing? Dad, stop! You haven't, you haven't sharpened your mower blades yet. But I'm almost out of time. This is overkill. We might be getting some rain. I don't have time to sharpen my mower blade yet. I need to cut the grass now while it's still dry. That way I have time. Dad, it doesn't take that long to sharpen your mower blades. Like you have a trick to sharpening it in like a couple minutes. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, I guess you're right. I guess so. let's go do that now then. Dad, that doesn't really look that easy. No, it's not that big of a deal. I gotta get some wood in here to kind of block it so that the thing doesn't turn. Um, but then... And then I gotta get this set to the right setting there so that I can actually spin this. Dad, it looks like you're gonna strip that mud. Well, I might. Yeah, I might. No, Dad, I'm gonna go get the right tools. What's in the box? It's the right tools. Oh, okay. Oh, it's the exact tools that I need to easily take my blade off every time without even thinking, right? Yeah. That's why I put this box together. Everyone should put a box like this together. It's got my blade stop, so I don't need the wood. And it's got this, perfectly sized for my mower blade. That is a lot easier. Thank you. You're welcome. All right, my kids obviously keep me in line sometimes. They remind me when I'm doing something that's not so smart. But the important thing to take away from this silly little skit that we put together is getting your mower blade off in the first place quickly and efficiently. One of the easiest ways that you can actually start sharpening your mower blade more regularly. Most of the time, the simple act of getting the mower tipped on its side and the blade off is like, ah, uh, I don't know where all of the tools are. Get yourself a shoe box. Stick a blade stop in there. Find the exact size hex nut for your lawnmower and stick it in the box. You don't even need this ratchet. This is like the old school way of doing it. You can actually get a drill attachment and put the drill attachment in the box so you can use your drill to turn the nut. If you keep a dedicated little shoe box of these little accessories and you don't use any of these accessories for anything else ever, then you always know exactly where they are and you can always get your mower blade off almost at a moment's notice. Now, how do you sharpen the mower blade? That's up to you. There's a whole bunch of different ways to do it. I stick my blade into a bench vise and then go to town on it with an angle grinder. That works best for me. But there's a whole bunch of other ways that you can do it. Now, if you don't have one of these uh, blade stops, these things are uh, crazy cheap. You can probably find them at a uh, like a discount like hardware store in your own town. This one is one that I just bought online, which I'll link to down below. I'm pretty sure it's just a generic brand. I can't even remember. But more importantly, get the blade off so that you can then set a pattern of sharpening it easily. Once the blade is off, I can take it into my garage and sharpen it in a couple minutes. Watch this video right up here. This video is all about the different ways that you could sharpen your mower blade once that blade is off. Not only do I describe the different ways that you could do it, I explain why I have chosen my own preferred method. Hope this video helped and thank you to all of my children.